For close to 30 years, students from the Waterloo Catholic District School Board have been given the opportunity to come away from their regular routine of school life and experience a retreat. During the upcoming weeks, your son or daughter will be one of these students as they participate in the retreat. This is a guided, live-in experience designed to integrate faith with life. It will be both an important and exciting time for your child. The presentation is meant to assist you, the parents or guardians, in preparation for your child's retreat. You will be given the rationale behind the retreat experience, information about the retreat site, some practical information about packing, medication, consent forms, and expectations. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to ask your child's teacher, the school principal, or the chaplain who will be facilitating the retreat. The elementary retreat experience gives students another opportunity to work toward the fulfillment of the Ontario Catholic School graduate expectations. As such, the retreat focuses on building a Catholic Christian community lifestyle. Students participate in a variety of activities, both indoor and out, which help them to build confidence, a positive sense of self, to discover and encourage goodness in others by working effectively as a team member. Overall, our hope and prayer is that the students experience the presence of Christ in their lives, in each other, and in our world through celebration and prayer. The entire retreat seeks to integrate body, mind, and spirit. The retreat planning process begins a few months in advance with the teachers, school principals, and elementary chaplain. Every retreat is designed to meet the specific needs and culture of each school. In planning a retreat, staff honors the needs of each group of students and develops the activities, discussions, and liturgies specific to those needs. The principal and teachers at this school have chosen to bring the students to the Mount Mary Immaculate Retreat Center in Ancaster, near Hamilton. Located within an hour of the region of Waterloo, Mount Mary is owned and operated by the Sister Servants of Mary Immaculate. It is comprised of over 100 acres of land on the edge of the Dundas Conservation Area and Bruce Trail. Students will usually hike on sections of this trail as part of their retreat. The main building at Mount Mary is a converted high school complete with dining rooms, meeting rooms, classrooms, a gymnasium, beautiful chapel, and separate dorms for boys and girls. Throughout the entire retreat, students are fully supervised by retreat school and staff. They begin their day at approximately 7 a.m. and work through the various activities and programming until about 9 p.m. Lights out usually happens between 10 and 10.30 p.m. The day is filled with a variety of physical, spiritual, and community building activities that promote a balanced and healthy lifestyle. Each activity on the retreat is planned to help students grow deeper in their knowledge of self, others, and God. Students are given the opportunity to develop personal and social skills, to reflect and share their faith in large and small groups, to participate in meaningful prayer experiences, and to engage in reflection. While on retreat, students are served three meals a day, as well as two snacks, one in the afternoon and one in the evening. Students are also given the opportunity to help out during the community mealtime by clearing their own tables and assisting with the washing of the dishes. Please let the school staff know if your son or daughter has special dietary needs, especially allergies. This will assist us in ensuring appropriate meals are prepared and available for your child. Safety is of the utmost importance while on retreat. The staff lays out clear expectations for the students to ensure that each activity is both safe and fun. If students violate any safety procedures or refuse to adhere to the retreat guidelines, consequences could include the student being sent home at the family's expense. We will now provide some practical suggestions to help assist your child in preparing for their retreat. Packing for a retreat is an important part of preparation. We ask that students come prepared for whatever season in which their retreat takes place. Warm, comfortable clothing for outside activities is essential year-round. Rain gear is another important item, as we are outside rain or shine, except in the event of lightning. 
Appropriate footwear is very important for activities such as hiking on trails and games in which students will participate while on retreat. We ask that students bring at least two pairs of running shoes, one for outdoor use and one for indoors. T-shirts, comfortable pants, or shorts are important. The school guidelines for appropriate clothing apply to the retreat. We ask that students bring clothes that they don't mind getting dirty as a number of activities are outdoors. Sunscreen and bug re repellent are necessary in the early fall and spring. Gloves and warm jackets are needed in the late fall and winter. Backpacks, water bottles, and hats are a year-round necessity. Linen and pillows are provided at Mount Mary, but students need to bring their own towels, toiletries, and other personal items. We would ask that you ensure that your child does not bring the following. Any music, money, alarm clocks, wristwatches, junk food, snacks of any kind, jewelry, or cell phones. In preparation for the retreat, we ask you take the time to complete all of the appropriate forms of consent and hand them back to the school staff promptly. If at any time you have a question with regard to anything that has been covered in this presentation, please do not hesitate to ask the staff. We wish you, the parents and guardians, every blessing as you walk through this preparation and as you support your child on their faith journey. We hope the upcoming retreat is a meaningful faith experience for your children and that they are able to see God in themselves, one another, and their surroundings. We would encourage you to pray for your child and his or her classmates, that their retreat will help give them a clearer glimpse of their goodness and of God's unconditional love for them.